I think that the the Yashiraj corrupt package may be like too much, and Taylor might not be that good because hitting Yashiraj isn't that good. But at least it's something that like give, you know gives us some mid game defense. Whereas like Restrix, I think is just like kind of greed. It's fun, but we're already very very greedy. I don't think we have enough fragment for Drinker, and I also don't think that you want Drinker when you're on the Nazoth plan. Uh, now now we can't gain armor from a uh, from a fortunate. Uh, Prime, though. Cargath Prime. Did you have Forge Run? I don't even know what Castle Architect is. What is Castle Architect? What's the Vegas occasion? There's a magic event this weekend, and I'm mostly just going to hang out with people who I don't get to see, or I haven't seen in a you know, long time because there haven't been magic events. This guy's a toast. Played Nazoth Warrior with Vandar. I have not. Kind of an interesting idea. Maybe we'll try that next. That's actually kind of a cool idea. You can't play armor vendors because they ruin Vandar. That's a good one. Six mana four. This is yeah. I don't think I don't think we want something like that. They don't even have they don't have types or anything, right? That's just that's just like throwing some bodies in the way. Does not seem worth to me. Holding this to kill something, rather than just playing it and getting hit by an assassin. Countless in the deck is interesting. Double stealth when I just played those school spirits. Hmm. Boom. Target eliminated. Well, we're glad that we didn't. That we didn't let that get a uh, value here. So they're gonna draw a bounce thing off the scabs. We're gonna get a bounce thing. We can. Yeah, I think just Dreadlord into Strongman into, into Pearl Tusk. So that's currently. Both of their, yeah, both of their things so far. They can play scabs, bounce this guy. Why not play the zero cost? Because I don't want to get assassinated, as I was saying before. And they literally, they literally played an assassin for no value to get their scabs online, and then we were able to kill the assassin and get value off of, off of our zero cost guy. Okay. Oh, wow! From the mole? That's insane! Shadow Bitblade Slinger from the mole. They kill both of my big dudes. Jeez.
Yeah, I'm dead. That was insane. So, I only had the the claw machine and the uh, the beast die this got bounced. So yeah, we're dead. Like we can't we can't kill the scabs. This brings back things that don't have taunt. Ripperoonie. God, that was brutal. Oh, that shadow blade slinger off of off of the mole got us good. Oof. Well, we're keeping these in case it's aggro. Uh, well, now it looks like they're probably celestial alignment. Yep. Mm hmm. What deck do you usually play magic? I tend to play green creature decks. Boom! Creature. That does not work how you want it to work. <laughs> There's still another one in your deck, friend. An innocent <laughs> That's pretty funny. <laughs> Hi, it's your cost eight eight. It's sort of a four cost eight eight, but we managed to corrupt it and play it on turn five. What do they just try? So they used Moonlit Guidance to discover their Vandar, but they still have the Vandar in their deck because it's discover a copy, and the copy being in their deck meant that Vandar's battle cry did not activate. So that's that's what just happened. Didn't. Shouldn't they have the other one in their hand because they played it, though? So wh why aren't they playing their other Vandar? I'm slightly confused. I'm just going to play this. Ooh, okay. Big Fizzy. Um, so they're playing Fizzy, they they certainly have Nazoth. I'm gonna go for mana efficiency here, and I don't want to leave this open to possibly getting killed by, like, a uh, claw machine if they have that, so I don't want to school spirits. Another fizzy. Mm -hmm. And now I'm rewarded for not playing this last turn from a mana perspective. Now I have giant enhanced dreadlord. This currently just gives me the pearl tusk because I played the strongman uncorrupted. But this is a 10 10 and an 8 8. Mutinous. Okay. Big mutinous. Taunting it. Okay. Um, so 50-50 that this is lethal. Lethal. So yeah. There's a lesson, everyone. It's kind of like, uh... What was it? Stitch Tracker into Keliseth? Doesn't work. Moonlit Guidance into Vandar? Doesn't work. Take this as a lesson.